This is an ABC 10 News update. Hello, I'm Jim Patton with this ABC 10 News update. We are now just one week away from the state's reopening, and there's a lot of optimism this morning. Our COVID case rates are low, and the county could even move into the yellow tier ahead of the grand reopening. And that would mean expanded capacity at restaurants, gyms, movie theaters, amusement parks, sports venues, and museums. And bars can open indoors without serving meals. Well, today we could find out more about how hundreds of millions of dollars in COVID relief money will be spent in the county. Board of Supervisors set to vote on the framework to divvy up the $650 million. Supervisors are considering making hazard pay for frontline union workers a priority. And there's a framework that calls for $85 million for homeless services and $50 million for small business stimulus. The county supervisors could vote today on creating a new local office dedicated to helping local immigrants and refugees. The office would serve as a hub where immigrants could receive available resources, including legal services. The plan is being pushed by supervisors Nathan Fletcher and Nora Vargas. According to the ACLU, more than 20 percent of San Diegans were born in other countries and speak 68 different languages. Let's check in with Megan now on our weather picture today. Megan, how are we doing? Well, today is going to be a little bit warmer than it was yesterday. The biggest jump in temperatures for our inland neighborhoods, where we're going to be about 5 to almost 10 degrees warmer than yesterday. We'll also see more sunshine today. We'll also see some high clouds building later today. So a mix of sun and clouds. Anything from mostly cloudy to mostly sunny for the coast and inland neighborhoods. 60s to 70s for the coast, inland, and mountain areas with 90s in the deserts. And today is just the beginning of a warming trend. We'll see faster and better clearing of the marine layer in the days ahead. And by this weekend... It is going to be feeling more like summer. We'll see more 70s along our coastline with 80s for our inland neighborhoods. And our warm weather, well, it sticks around into early next week. Jim? Megan, thank you very much. And for the latest news, weather and traffic, go to 10news.com or download our free 10 News app in your app store. For ABC 10 News, I'm Jim Patton.